Sabbat Shalom, Beth Yeshua. How's everybody today? You're all looking good, like I always say. I love looking out there, those smiley faces. I can even see the people on live stream. How you doing, Eric? <laughs> Welcome, everyone. Well, I have good news this week. What do you think that is? <laughs> Spot on. Spot on. That's great. And uh, Rabbi Robichek, thank you for all you did for him while he was up there in the hospital. Thank you so much. Everybody have a good week this week otherwise? So did I. And uh, today is kindly family day for, for us, for our family. The in-laws, the outlaws, the kids, everybody, we're all getting together. So... <laughs> So it's a privilege to be able to do that, at least, you know, once a year that everybody can get together. And uh, I'm so thankful for that. I'm thankful for my kids, uh, my grandkids also. Um, the little ones have been gone. One, one is four years old, and the other one's gone on three years old, and the other one's like a year old. Well, the three and the five-year-old, four-year-old, they've been going to like day school, like four days a week. And uh, the one good thing is they have... Christian teachers, believers. And my four-year-old, his teacher's a praise and worship leader. So he comes home singing these praise and worship songs. And so I actually have pictures that my son sent me of him in front of the TV and they're playing gospel music on the big screen TV. And he's got a microphone like I'm holding and he's there just singing away. And it just thrills my heart. And he's got this little keyboard that we bought him just, you know, for, for uh, a starter. And he gets on that and he really can't play anything with it, but he's just banging away and then he's got a guitar that he plays upside down. And I don't know, <laughs> I'm gonna have to get Darren with him on that one. I, I don't know how he does that and why he even does it that way, but you know, it makes him happy and I enjoy listening to him sing. Well, the little girl, Emmy, she looks so much like Noriko, my wife, that everybody thinks she's our daughter instead of our granddaughter. Well. I have a picture of her where she's doing her other grandmother's hair. And you know, my wife's a hairdresser, so how does that figure in, right? <laughs> so she came to the shop yesterday and, and uh, Noriko was there finishing up and she wanted to come in and start doing some hair. So uh, I guess it runs in the family, it's on both sides. Anyway, enough of me. <laughs> I just had to share that because it just, just thrills my heart. Anyway, I'm gonna read from Psalm 27 this morning. If you have uh, your Bibles with you, you can follow along. Psalm 27, let your heart take courage. Adonai is my light and my salvation. Whom should I fear? Adonai is the stronghold of my life. Whom should I dread? When evildoers approach me to devour my flesh, my adversaries and my foes, they stumbled and fell. Though an army camp besieges me, my heart will not fear. Through war breaks out against me, even then will I be confident. One thing have I asked of Adonai that I will seek, to dwell in the house of Adonai all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of Adonai and to meditate to his temple. For in the day of trouble, he will hide me in his sukkah. Conceal me in the shelter of his tent and set me high upon a rock. Then will my bread be, then will my head be high above my enemies around me. In his tabernacle, I will offer sacrifices with shouts of joy. I will sing, yes, sing praises to Adonai. Hear Adonai when I call with my voice. Be gracious to me and answer me. For you, my heart says, seek my face. Your face, Adonai, I seek. Do not hide your face from me. Do not turn your servant away in anger. You have been my help. Do not abandon me or forsake me, O oh God, my salvation. Though my father and my mother forsake me, Adonai will take me in. Teach me your way, Adonai, and lead me on a level path. Because of my enemies, do not turn me over to the desire of my foes. For false witnesses rise up against me, 
breathing out violence. Surely I trust that I will see the goodness of Adonai in the land of the living. Wait for Adonai. Be strong in your heart. Take courage and wait for Adonai. May the Lord bless his word. This morning, Adonai, as we come before you in your house, in your sacred place, we thank you, Lord, for walking up and down these aisles and being with us and ministering through each and every heart. We pray, Lord, that uh, you will be with us the rest of the day, that you will watch over us as we make our way to leave the sanctuary. But most of all, Lord, while we're here, we just ask you that you would give us a holy visitation of your Holy Spirit. Let your Spirit speak to our hearts and fix whatever's wrong in our lives, that we may be truer lights for you. May we be the lighthouse of your word so that others may see you through us. I just thank you, Lord, for this time. I thank you, Lord, as Rabbi Robichek comes to minister to us this morning. I thank you, Lord, for uh, everything that you've done for us this week and everything you're going to continue to do. And I ask this in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach. Amen.